Well, LensCD is, is a really remarkable collection of people, um, a real community of practice that evolved from people who were concerned about the effectiveness of capacity development in aid projects. And it has stuck together for the last 10 years, uh, working mainly in the aid effectiveness agenda, trying to influence the way development partners uh, uh, design their programs and how they work on the whole question of building capacities in countries. We've had a pretty important influence on the way um, uh, capacity development is pursued by uh, development uh, organizations. LNCD has been very important in helping us give meaning to something which is very difficult to define, and that is capacity development. So I think um, in articulating the ideas and facilitating the dialogue, I think that would be a significant contribution of um, the network. LNCD has helped demonstrate some of the key concepts. Um, for example, that um, the dynamism within um, capacity development, the fact that capacity development is goes the whole spectrum from individuals right to institutions, the involvement of individuals, of organizations, of groups, and to the institutional factors. I think that's very important. When I think about LENCD and how it's evolved in the past 10 years, there are two scenarios that come to my mind. One, it's been like a vehicle. It's a vehicle that has taken on different ideas, gone through a very changing landscape, as we do know capacity development is about working in dynamic situations. And so it's been this vehicle that has transversed this landscape. And during that time, through this journey, it's taken on different actors at different times. It has gone through different situations. And it has evolved through them. And it has persisted through that journey. So that um, the issues being articulated were quite different before Accra. And I think Accra, uh, the, the meetings that LENCD helped facilitate the forums before that were very important in putting capacity development on the map. The other analogy I can give is of a sort of a revolving door. Because um, I see LENCD is important as a space. A lot of these platforms are important as space. And I see LENCD as sort of the interface between um, different um, landscapes. And it's a revolving door where, you know, you can go in, you're transformed, you leave something in and out of that space, different actors come, some remain, some leave, and people take different roles. I'll give myself as an example. I have worked with, I suppose, five different organizations since I joined the network, and the network still remains relevant and important to my work. LENCD was able to put capacity development on the agenda. LENCD, working with the OECD, uh, produced the guide to capacity development. LENCD <coughs> also uh, had a role to play even for uh, uh, NEPA developing the Africa platform for development effectiveness. So those are the well pillars or milestones as we've come uh, thus far. And post Busan, also, again, LENCD is taking so, some sort of a leadership role in the Effective Institutions platform, especially on the, on the issue around making reform happen.